like music. Because when you hear that sound, you know something's fixing to get wonked up in Dog Man's kitchen. And that's exactly what's going down, guys. Ah, I've got some Butcher Box Sweet Italian Sausage. Uh, one of my subscribers, JB Conway, sent me a big box of meat. So we're going to make some sandwiches out of these. And let me bust these dudes open. Oh, it's going to be one of them packages. Oh. All right, I just need a hole. Yank them out of there. Come on out of there. Goodness, what in the name of Billy Squire? Yeah. All right, this is one of my favorite air fryers. I've got three, but this works good for sausages. All I do is it comes in a little basket like that. Yes, it's clean. I just washed it. Along with the other 7,000 dirty dishes that were piled up on this counter. All right. Well, we're just going to put these in here. Like so. And I don't ever mess with any of them settings. I don't even... Because I didn't read the, you know, the... I never read the... I can't say... I can't even say it, man. I never read the piece of paper that comes with this. All I know is you turn it on. Time on this side, temperature on this side. 15 minutes sounds good. Just crank that dude to about 380. And you gotta make that motion right there. Or it ain't gonna work. All right, we're gonna let that cook. By the time we get everything else done, we'll be ready to make our sandwiches. All right, gonna chop up the bell pepper from out of my garden. About the only things that really did any good this year. Shake them seeds out of there. All right. We're just gonna slice these up a long ways. That's how they're going on the sandwich. Long ways. And then this one here is designated for the mouth. Mm, right now. Throw them dudes in there. When you finish chewing, put a little bit of onion in there. Mm. Huh. I showed that piece of onion, didn't I? All right. We're going to saute. All right. All right. Got the stove top on. We're gonna slap in some butter. Mm. Don't be shy with that butter. You ever notice? Usually in your butter, you always got some like pieces of toast in there. That's cool. Sometimes you might have some jelly in there. I don't know. And let's add a can of butt sliced mushrooms, pieces, and stems. And we'll put a little Lowry's on there. And since it is an Italian dish, we got to have the garlic, pepper, salt. Oregano. Get it on there. And what's the other Italian spice? Basil. <laughs> Get some basil on there. Right, we're gonna saute that. If y'all have never seen my cooking videos, that's S A W T A Y E D. Sauteed. Right, gonna let that go to town. And I am gonna put a few drops of liquid smoke on up in there. Guys, let me tell you what I did the other night. I went to, uh, I don't even remember what the heck I was heating up. But I put it on this burner. Oh, I was making uh, macaroni and cheese. Put it on this burner, and when the noodles were done boiling, I turned that dude to the low setting just to keep it warm so I could melt the cheese and such in there. Well, about 
the next evening I set something on top of that burner and I kept smelling something and I was cooking at the time but I couldn't figure out what it was I put it was a pizza uh, pizza box I put the box on the burner man so you got to I'm gonna ban myself from evening cooking especially if I've had a few cold snacks you know all right let's get this get going here all right now these are probably six inch ogie rolls I'm gonna slice these dudes right down the top there I'm gonna make two I ain't gonna be able to eat two but I'm gonna have one I'll package it up and eat it later but I only eat once a day believe it or not but when I do hmm, I'll make it nice well these ain't nothing but bread I'm gonna butter that dude up like that we're gonna toast these lightly on a skillet over there See, I cut too far into them this is one item that's pretty hard to find around here that's any good it's hoagie buns alright so we got them all buttered up and we'll bring them over here and put them on the skillet Gonna set these on here, let them get a little warm. And and if it doesn't fit into the thing, you smash it. Smash it in there. Ah! Look at that, it just bounced right back. Yeah, let's check in on this. at about where we need it right there. Yep, yep. Okay. Now let's get to the fun stuff. I'm going to take Catadina Funky Coke Catadina These things You know I wish I'd go back in a time machine and whoop that boy's butt that poisoned them Tylenol pills because he started all this Now we're just going to squirt just a little bit in there you don't want you don't want it so so bad that it's dripping all down your shirt and your chin gets stuck in your beard. Uh, look at that! Look at that! Uh huh. Uh, what I like to do if you got a messy spoon, rather than setting that on a plate or something, just just lick it off, man. Why would it's a dish? All right, we're getting that. Getting these things. Is this thing even on? Sometimes I turn the wrong burners on. Yeah, it's on. This is see, I should have thrown that thing out, but I kept it. it. Doesn't have a handle. It's good for stuff like that. All right. Sesame Sesame says stop. That ain't how you do that. Simon says. Well, I don't know what Simon. I don't know. Oh yeah, those are done. All right. Start burning the heck out of my cupboard or my counter. All right, I'm just going to toss two of them dudes in there. I'm going to show you what we're going to do next. Put this back here. Let it sit until I get done with the video. All right, what we're going to do now is we're going to try to create two little separate piles here. One for each sandwich. Don't cheat the other one. Make sure they got the exact amount of stuff, okay? Get that over a little more. I can already see a mess when I go to eat. All right, we're gonna take some mozzarella cheese. Excuse me. And yes, Miss Rooster is nearby. She's already heard the cheese package. My goodness, separate it. Gotta separate it. I'm gonna strap that dude right there. I like cheese. It's good. I can back in there so I can get the business. I spared you all the agony of opening these kind of packages. I did it in advance. And we have provolone cheese. Just one piece there. That takes a little longer to melt. 
Now we're going to cover that up for a minute and we're ready to build the sandwich. Would you just look at that? <clears throat> now I had to get this off the stove because Miss Rooster wanted to lay there. Don't look like the sausage was big enough for the bun, but that's all right. Oh, mozzarella. Look at that, man. That sausage is in there. I need to just scoot it over. Now, this will most likely be having be eaten with a fork because this this hoagie bun is just terrible but we'll we'll make it taste good guys shake it for some reason look at there mm. all right guys there she is italian sausage sandwich with melted provolone and mozzarella Ooh, that's good mm. And of course, I'm going to wash it down with ice cold milk swig right out of the daggum jug. Because why waste a perfectly clean glass? Happy trails. Mm -hmm.